Xin Fin is a hybrid blockchain that combines the ability of public and private blockchains with functionally compatible smart contracts. Yes, you guessed it. This video review will be dedicated to a unique blockchain about the features and benefits of which, in fact, I will tell you now. So, don't switch and watch this video until the end. And those who watch me for the first time, I suggest that you subscribe to my channel and click on the bell to continue to receive from me the most interesting information about projects, tokens, platforms from the world of cryptocurrencies. In the meantime, back to Xinfin. After all, as I said, this is the world's first hybrid blockchain that combines not only the power, transparency and security of public blockchains, but also the high transaction speed that has become available thanks to the delegated confirmation of shares of XDPoS, which in turn allows you to create hybrid relay bridges and almost instantaneous completion of blocks. Just look at the speed, however. To help you understand what XDPoS is, please refer to the Frequently Asked Questions section, where it is said that the Xinfin network is based on the Xinfin Delegated Proof of Stake Consensus, or short for XDPoS, which makes the Xinfin network EVM compatible and scalable public blockchain, on which each Ethereum smart contract can work effectively with almost instant transaction confirmation. And all because the Xinfin network uses a system consisting of 108 masternodes with these consensors, which are able to maintain low commissions of about 100 of the Ethereum commission and the transaction confirmation speed of about 2 seconds. And this is, as you understand, is 10 times faster than the same Bitcoin and Ethereum. Yes, what is there to deceive? If you look at a more detailed comparative table, we will see that unlike other blockchains, namely such as Bitcoin, Ethereum and Dash, XDC has a maximum TPS value, which is already more than 2000 TPS. And this I want to tell you is very cool. But this, as they say, is not only advantage of XDC over the rest, because in addition to speed and low commissions, XDC is also private and profitable since it provides a return on all its masternodes from 8 to 12%, which I also think is undoubtedly a plus. By the way, there were two tokens in the Xinfin network up to the current moment. One of them is the XDC token, which is actually the basic service token of the entire hybrid blockchain network. Acting as a calculation engine for all the apps built on the Xinfin hybrid blockchain, which I will discuss in more detail later. In the meantime, I will return to the XDC token, which is an ERC20 standard token. It's worth noting that the team decided to abandon this token, so anyone who has this token on the balance can easily exchange it for an XDC token in one-to-one -one ratio. On the exchange alpharex.net, the contract burning date is the 31st of March 2021. There is not much time left, so hurry up! All this was done only for the generator popularization of its main XDC token and its integration with other wallets, payments, gateways and tools. You can read the article about the rejection yourself, and I will definitely attach all the related links in the description. And now, let's finally talk about what was created on the basis of the XDC service token from Xinfin. As you can see, there are a lot of developments, but most of all I want to draw your attention to some of them, namely Trade Phoenix, Block Degree, My Contract, and Excel Trip. So what is Trade Phoenix? Trade Phoenix is a P2P trade finance platform for creating valuable trading instruments between buyers and sellers in the trade finance market. It's worth noting that it is an open protocol for banks, institutions, and users and the management under the leadership of the consortium makes it truly decentralized. That is, the Trade of Phoenix platform will help buyers obtain capital and globally competitive rates, provide its suppliers with information about global tenders and the customer base, and provide financiers with real-time information about their investments by digitizing their assets and integrating the Internet of Things. Which I think is very cool. 
I will leave a link to the platform for more detailed information in the description. In the meantime, I'm happy to introduce you to the Blog Degree, an academy created specifically to raise user awareness of the Xinfin platform. In the simple term, Blog Degree provides online training for blockchain engineers and specialists. That is, all these engineers and professionals can take basic and advanced courses from Block Degree and even start developing other products for Xenofin later. To register in Block Degree, you can follow the link that I will also attach in the description under this video. As for my contract, it's a specially designed toolbar that is designed for creating and managing assets and for all their types. That is, they can include both community coins, bonds, real estate and other infrastructure assets. Moreover, my contract allows you to create your own token in just a few minutes without any programming skills. Just by providing all the necessary information, decimals, total offer volume, limit and so on. Thanks to its easy-to-understand environment, my contract will allow enterprises of any size to deploy their own smart contracts and tokens in various industries, with working use cases in supply chain and decentralized lending applications, which you will agree is very convenient. What do you think about this? Write your thoughts on this in the comments. In the meantime, I will introduce you to another concept that uses the XDC token as a means of payment, called this decentralized solution XLTRIP. It's worth noting that XLTRIP is a next-generation blockchain-based solution that was designed, no matter how loud it sounds, to undermine the entire trillion-dollar tourism industry, along with an expanding partner base of more than 1.5 million hotels and 400 airlines. And all because the platform seek to democratize the use cases of blockchain and cryptocurrency, that is, using the platform's web applications, all Excel Trips users will be able to pay for their trips using Bitcoin, Ethereum, as well as using the XDC token. I don't know about you, but I think it's very cool. At the same time, thanks to an extensive number of partnerships, you can easily purchase an XDC token through one of the listed exchanges, namely through Alphax, Bitfenix, Hotbit, and many others, using the type of wallet that is most convenient for you. After all, you will agree that the more tools you have at your disposal for interaction, the better. But that's not all, because since the 2nd of December 2020, Stablecoins have been issued on the basis of the XDC Xinfin blockchain by the Global Financial Services Group, Globians. They are also called SGDG and EURG. It's worth noting that these stablecoins are pegged to Singapore dollar and euro and are converted at the rate of 1 to 1. As for the question, why did Globians choose the Xinfin blockchain, then everything is simple. To use the speed, almost a zero gas charge and transaction time of 2 seconds. Moreover, Globians does not intend to stop at two stablecoins, so in the near future they will add such stablecoins as GBPG, HCardG, CNYG, JPYG, USDG, and KRWG for the European, Asian, African, and American markets, which I think is very cool. By the way, if you look at the token through such an information resource as CoinMarketCap, we will see that despite its small value of $0.035, which is relevant at the time of recording this video, the trading volume still impresses me, since it's almost 4 million US dollars. At the same time, the total market capitalization of XDC is generally just over 430 million US dollars. I don't know about you, but I'm in a pleasant shock. Moreover, I'm sure this is just the beginning. Since I sincerely believe that XDC and Xinfin have a great future, and in the near future he will demonstrate more than a dozen Xs. After all, in addition to all that I have already mentioned, the XDC token itself is also a green coin. They call it so because for its production, renewable and alternative sources of green energy will be used which is released by solar panels, wind turbines, bioenergy and tides, which in turn allow ours to ensure not only a constant supply and production of the token with inexpensive green energy, but also to reduce all the damage 
to the environment caused by conventional mining using traditional sources of not renewable energy. In a word, is the sixth synthin managed to succeed here too? And what do you say about these? Write your thoughts on these in the comments. In the meantime, I thank you all for watching and say goodbye to you until my next video, which will be released on my channel very soon.